What's up, man? Welcome back to another episode of the Bowling Green Dynasty Rebuild. Hey, yeah. And in today's episode, we kicking off season six, big six. You know what I'm saying? We starting off number four. This is absolute bullshit. I don't know why, but we're number four right now, and we have to deal with it. But anyway, we have Army on the schedule and before we get into all this i would like to send a special shout out to matt aarons who is getting married on january the 7th oh shit! this coming up january so congratulations to matt aarons he wanted me to deliver a special message he said tell joey go army beat navy so shout out to you matt aarons congratulations once again i hope your marriage is everything you and your special other wants it to be <laughs> But anyway, they say this game against Army is a mismatch. Shit! Number four, Bowling Green opens up the season against lowly Army. Wow, the disrespect. <laughs> but anyway, man, if you haven't already, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell, all that good stuff. Drop a little something down in the comments for your boy. I be looking, I sure do, and I really don't want to hold this up any longer. I'm ready to hop into this game. All right, since this is the first game, we do not have any team stats, but we do have team ratings. As you can see, your BGSU Falcons have a 91 overall rating to Army's 83. Our offense is a 95 to Army's 84, and our defense is a 88 to Army's 82. I feel like that is the best our defense has been rated in this game so far. So we're going to see what the defense does against a lowly army. <laughs> top players for army we got a 85 overall qb an 85 overall wide receiver and an 84 overall defensive tackle for your lobos we have a 97 overall kicker a 93 overall cornerback and a 93 overall wide receiver d hill jesse williams and jimmy warren and also before i forget shout out to cadet blake edwards this also from matt aarons Glad to have you with us in the studio. I'm Reese Davis, bringing you the EA da, da, Sports da, da, NCAA da, Football 14 pregame show da, 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 by da, da, da. Innovation It's time to when play, you play for Army, another you're not just game. The academy, you're playing for the history and the tradition and the great stars who come before you oh, yeah. and been ah. a member of the Black Knights of the Hudson. Army, just about set to yeah. go. That's going to do it for us here on the free game. Down here NCAA at Football Army. 14 action coming on the road right now. to start Nestor off the season. I love it. Oh, the man is parachuting in. Oh, my God. <laughs> oh, my God. We are intimidated already. But it's time to go. All hands on deck. We trying to make Army sweat. In a bad way, not in a good way. Yeah. Look at that mascot. I hope he getting paid. Cause that suit looks terrible. <laughs> Let's go! West Point, New York, home of the oldest military post in America. Because no disrespect. But welcome back to the Bowling Green war. series. Everybody, let's get this season started. Season, season six. All right, baby. Season six. Let's go. Okay, Joe. After a nice run up the middle. Slide down. You talk about a dual threat guy. Got some new plays in the playbook this year. Ah, uh, that didn't go over well. Never really had a shot. They were on him Damn. almost as soon as he took the handoff. Should have let it go. Oh my God. Nobody even got a hand on that man. Uh, He's on the run. Hit him. And get nothing. Okay. Slow start already. He punts it away. It's a high kick. And and now. The 19 yard line. Okay, defense. He's out to the 30. And it's so not a good 34. start. 
Yeah, he couldn't pitch it. Took that option away. I need somebody to come with me. He's taken down at midfield. So he keeps it and he gets a big Damn. first down. Finish him. Get him. And he's going to be sacked. Coach is like when their quarterback gets hit like that. Don't be surprised to see the old coach get Let go, my boy. The quarterback a little bit better. K.A. loading up the AK. Let it spray spray. You can get sacked on any day, on any play. And they running in the own. Oh, my God. They hey, running on second and long, bro. I was not expecting it. Looks like it's just gonna be a run, run, run offense. Very, very methodical and very consistent. Oh my! Pulls down the catch. Good tackle, Air Graham. What impresses me so much is the guy's vision. He read the coverage perfectly. I missed. I missed on the sack. Nope. Ah, uh, punch! He's tackled at the eight. Oh, man, they just walking right down the field. That'll bring up second and three. Touchdown. And there's a touchdown. Why am I not surprised? This guy seems to make things happen no matter what kind of space he has to work with. All he needs is a little crease of daylight. And he has it on the corner. He's to the 40. All right. Rounds around the 47 yard line. There's a big gainer. Big 15 from number eight. He's going to go for the home run. Ah, uh, just no, out of his reach. Incomplete. He let that pass get away from him. That was a good warm up pass. He's taking down at the 42. Decent run here on the right side. Oh boy. We going for it. And you know what we going to do. He's not wanting to give an inch here. You know what we going to do? Turn on the Jazz Joe. Turn on the Jazz Joe. Turn it down. Touchdown. When Joe get them just turned on, that was simply he'll run it right up in your home. It shows you what kinds of major things can happen. Put a touchdown a across your dome. Nothing seems to work. It's going to be interesting to see. There we go. Have an impact on this drive. <gasps> Got some open field. He's so I don't get no tackle animation. Y'all seen that, Dean? Inside the thirty. Did y'all not see that? I'm right there in the man face. What do I have to do? What do I have to do? <laughs> what do I have to do to get a tackle animation, bro? You gotta be kidding me, man. Boy, ain't no fucking way, boy. Nice run up the middle. And watch that be a face mask. Personal foul. Face man. Defense. Oh, brother, this guy stinks! New guy starting. They're giving away oh, three yards. Yeah. Touchdown. Touchdown. Army. Got to figure out this defense again. That gives him another touchdown to go along with the one he scored earlier. That was just an excellent individual effort for the kick. <laughs> Taken from the three yard line. Got the corner. Down the sideline. It's going to be a mistake. And it's going to be. Y'all keep kicking the Zach Mess. There we go. Tackle made at the and that's the red line. shirt freshman, Ronald Freeman. Oh my God. Somebody hit the upset alert button because this one looks like it just might be. We are on upset alert. Already. Against Army. Army is not a bad team. Oh shit. Here we go again. Ah, I should have kept it. Scrambling around. 
Decides to Let me get it here. He's got space. And he's Ooh, got close to the first down. Don't catch this TD from Joe. And once again, he finds the end zone. That's his second rushing touchdown of the game. Gotcha, bitch. Come here. And he tackles him. And that's K. Look his second sack of the sack. game. Their quarterback just got hit That'll and hit hard. Line. If I'm an offensive coordinator, especially an offensive bam, line bam. coach, thank you, ma'am. I'm getting a hold of my offensive line. I don't know if they're gonna run it or pass it, and it's a run. Should have known. And of course, they're gonna get the first down off a damn run. No, God! Run down after a nice run up the middle. We ain't getting no push on the D line, man. They beating us completely with the and run. The stop around the 42 yard Finally. Line. Damn. Damn. At the 49 yard line. Bring him down. That's a great tackle at the 46 yard line. That's got to be very frustrating for that running back. This offense is trying to get in sync and trying to get a rhythm established. And Bring him down, K.A. Tackle after positive yardage. A crack. Quickly, and he's got his man brought down to 39 yard line. I ain't gonna lie, I'm getting cooked. They hand it off again. There we go. And he makes it out to about the 37 yard line. Bring him down. Bring him down. After a decent run up the gun. No, sir. I sent the blitz that time. That brings us fourth and seven. They call on the kicker for CPU a long doesn't believe he can make this field goal. Army is looking to go up by three. I'm not sold either. Yeah. He gets it up. <laughs> no <laughs> good. <laughs> Finally got to stop. A piece. I believe I can do. Takes a hand Damn, on the man, did nobody get open on the play action. There. Yes, it was. He did a wonderful job of fighting off blocks to bring the quarterback down. And this man beat a double team. Looks middle, got his back. And we only got three yards on that. Well, here I think the quarterback needs to be a little bit more patient in the pocket. That way he can allow his receivers to get downfield a little bit before he throws. Going deep. Got him. Mike Potts. And he's got it. He's going. He's going. Mike Potts. Get the peace pipe out. Mike Potts is on the way. Wide receiver. And not to take anything away from the quarterback, but the wide receiver made this play. Where was the coverage there? There wasn't anybody near him at all. Shit! Come here! K.A. got that boy again! They bring him down for a sack on the play. And that three sacks. For K.A. All right, so they caught a timeout. Are they going to start passing it? That's the question. No. Nope. Bring him down. Yeah, nah, yeah, nah, yeah, nah, yeah, Bring him down. And he's tackled around the 15 yard line. Yeah. He really got If y'all ain't gonna try to score, I am. Bridges fields it at the 40. He ah. gets out to about the 48 yard line. Bridges, the guy everyone has their eyes Old on. Old Jay right Bridges, now, aka he Clips. Comes with a lot of expectations. Time will only tell if he's the new hope or if he's all hype. Okay, got that block. In that block. And you big pots. It's big pots. No pans. He got hands. Do you understand what I'm saying? Oh man. <laughs> Makes it out to about the All right. All right. And he's taking Hit Matt Aaron's. About the 11. Right behind him, Mike Potts touchdown. Let's go. He 
Falls in his second touchdown catch. You know, this it's going to be the Mike Potts and Jay Jackson connection. Game. It usually doesn't matter who's covering him. He always With a little D. Hill and Matt Aarons. Oh, now he's going to pass it. He's tackled at the 39. Okay. He scrambled. No. Bring him down. At the 42. He's going to try and scramble. Dives forward. He got the first down. And down he goes. He's right around the 46. They want to call a timeout. Does he have the arm for a Hail Mary? That's what it's got to be. No, he going to get hit in the backfield. Right All right, so he has another chance. I'm coming again with Richardson. Going deep. Pick it off. Ah. Shot at the pick. We played a half of football. The All Falcons right. Lead. So after the slow start in the first quarter, of course, we come out and we score 21 in the second. Hi, everybody. And we held them scoreless. On the EA Sports NCAA Football 14 halftime show. So we don't need that. Well, I'm not going to say that. I'm not going to say it. Davis, Davis, not even going to say it. Studio, as always, <laughs> to lend a little perspective to what just went down in the first we just, 30 minutes. We just need Maybe to continue what we doing right now. No turnovers for either team. So far, I feel like we, we doing okay on the security, offensive side. You wonder, Defense starting to catch up. Can avoid putting the ball Mike in Potts jeopardy. showing off. Want to make a big play. And that might sort of set Jay Jackson showing his accuracy. Yeah, and it's in, in defenses. That's the number one priority. I mean, you can give up if you a lot of yards. <laughs> if you tune you into the live stream, up and down the field, but if you, you would have seen a whole bunch of inaccurate passes. And that's your number one goal. in practice. So I, defenses, but like I said, in practice, they don't really warm up right now, and they got to try to find ways to. to we hit just got to figure out how to slow this run down. I think we pretty much got it. Get the ball out. Try to get some interceptions. The adjustment is some just the blitz picks, you know, a lot. Do whatever you can to try to get the football back in that offense and set your offense up. And we got to make them pass it. About ready to start the second half. And they haven't really passed it in the first half. The Only 52 yards. Some coaches who like the, the run has killed us. The surface that they're playing on. I'll, I'll keep an eye on that. Yeah, I'm gonna go to the cafeteria. You want some turf, some astroturf or anything? Yeah. If Even when you think they about to the pass the ball, they run it on second down alone. Bitch. Okay, that that did not work. Gets to around the 42. And he makes it out to about All the right. 44 yard line. He throws it away immediately. Great job by the defense. He gets another carry. And they still ran it. And he makes it out to about the 42. And we get off the field. Again. This is yeah. Let it go, Jay. So this one goes into the end zone, and that'll be a touchback. There you go, Joe. Solid running right there. Laying it out there. Got him again. Mike Potts. Mike Potts. And they make the stop at the 11-yard line. He ain't got no elite speed or nothing like that, but... He finds ways to get open. And sometimes it's just running past the defense. And I'm okay with that. Ah. Run there. Bing bong. Damn, Joe. Gains about four yards on the play. For you to be 6'4", 200 and some pounds, you should be getting knocked around. He's taken down. Get the first down. down. Still can't get in there. I know what will get us in there. Second and goal. One yard to the And I know you know what will get us in there. Don't give it off here. Touchdown! Oh Joe. HB stretch to the left, to the left. Three rushing touchdowns on the ground. Running up, HB stretch to the left. This guy's been huge today. This offense has to step up and capitalize on this possession. Caught enough for the first down. I figured it was going across the middle. Now, are they going to strictly pass it, or that was just something to loosen us up? 
It might have been something just to loosen us up. Damn, hey, Jesse. And he's tackled in the open field. Uh, a little more passes here in the third like quarter. That, you've got the defense right where you want it. I just whiffed on the tackle completely. Falcon punch! Mm. To make it the 36 yard line. So the delayed handoff gets maybe a yard. No, sir. Makes it to the 35 yard line. Bring him down. He might have the leg for this one. Let me get on DRNA. It has the distance. And he nails Yeah, he made it. He actually made it. Okay. I don't even think he got the arm. I seen him way too late. The defender had it he was wide open. It. You took the full back. And they convert the first down on that run. He makes it out to maybe the 49-yard okay. line. He lets it fly. Bruh, Catch is that your best down. corner? Is that y'all best corner? Cause Mike Potts is cooking that boy. Let's it go. Tight end touchdown. Sam Smith. He has three My bro Jake Jackson is looking real good. Letting it fly today and his right now. That is a great touchdown. Come here! And that's a fumble and we got it! K.A. Put a strip sack on the play. What else is new? These guys have been dominating all day. And now they can add this fumble recovery. They've been on the quarterback here all game. It's like whatever this defense is trying just isn't working. But maybe if they uh, add just a little bit more pressure, then they might be able to force him into a mistake. He gets hit out of bounds. D Hill got him. Had to throw that with anticipation that he was gonna get open. But he was not open when I threw that ball. He makes it four scoring passes. Well, but he, he got off of the press. Back there in the pocket. That's the main reason he's been able to find the end zone so many times. Ah! I think I undercut it too much. And that will be the end of the third quarter. One to go. The Falcons are As Mike big. Potts is cooking the DBs. Joseph McKnight sprinkling in a little run. And Jay Jackson is looking pretty good at the starting QB position. Oh my god. Tackle made around the 45. That man threw him open, bro. He was not open when he threw that ball. And then they immediately run it. Straight run, nothing going on there. And he throws that out of bounds. Brad, I just think this quarterback's got to do much better. He's in trouble. Uh -huh. He's tackled at about the 31. Gets it out to the wall. Come on, he's Freddy. Got the first. He's taken down around the 18 yard line. And we in the backfield. Right and is brought down in the backfield. Oh! And they make the well, stop. I, I got both options that time. That brings up third and I thought he was going to get there, but he didn't. This one's going deep. Eric Williams, let's go! I think that interception pretty much sums up this whole game. Is that the Eric Williams' first interception? The defense simply stepped up and made yet another play. Going deep, lays it out. D Hill, and down he goes at about the 41. Don't let D Hill wake up now.
Don't let D Hill wake up. Bitch. All right, so they do not want us to run it, which is clear. He unloads it. He underthrew that one. Damn. Out to okay. The They're trying to hit hit out there, ain't they? Oh my God! That should have been picked off. I think Jimmy Warren can make this. They're already up big, and this could make the lead bigger. Cock and kick. The kick is up. It's got the distance. There we go. Good. Let's go to the studio for this Reese Davis update. And Central Michigan takes down Michigan State, 31 to 27. Michigan State is just on on the down. They going downhill. They going downhill, bro. Okay, so what are they going to try to do? Is it going to be pass? Yeah. Looks like pass there. Get him. And they got it. This pass rush is. And that would count as a sack. They're really getting after the quarterback now. Second and ten. Fires that that went to nobody. Oh, shit. I ain't gonna lie. I thought that was gonna be a, ru <laughs> a ruin. They really need to get something going in soon. Luckily, there was no receiver in the middle of the field. Bridges, back to return it. Well, I was supposed to cover. <laughs> C4 has been successfully activated. At the corner. Jay. He's at midfield. Oh my god. He's no. at the 30. To the 20. No. Oh. The 10. Oh my He's god. All the way in for the touchdown. <laughs> that's, that's the play that they score off of. Oh shit! Really? Y'all already down, bro. Why y'all gonna go with the onside kick? Cause Mike Potts is gonna catch it. Tackle at the forty. You know, I've been so caught up in these offensive players. The Mike Potts catches everything. What's happening on the a coming cold, the flu. I ain't gonna say the other one, but. <laughs> up the middle for a nice game. All right. Wants to go long and. Uh, and there's another one that's almost picked. DBs ain't got no hands. And he's hit and Zach Massey. And that completion gives him over 300 yards through the air. All right, so Jay has 300 yards passing. We're going to take him out of the game. Do not want to get him injured. We'll let Nick Wiley finish it off. Oh, my God, that boy didn't get he didn't get blocked at all. He couldn't get past those big linemen. You got that right. They sacrificed their bodies in there and stuffed it. Three, three, three. And hit immediately for terrible the attempt at a block. Deep ball laying it out there. Interception. And it's picked off. Nice interception. Too bad they weren't playing like this to start the day. Yeah, their defense took a little too long. To took get a shot at the end zone. There we go. To maybe the 20 yard line. Nope. Damn, He's up man. To rushing yards now. Oh. So to maybe the 30 yard line. You know, on these shorter distances to pick up the first down, to give the back enough room for the first down. That was supposed to be somebody in the middle of the field. Then there's a run. Nice run there. Green. Gains about four then they call timeout. I mean, is the CPU confused about what they want to do? Under a minute left. While run the ball, then call a timeout. <laughs> Give me that. And that just might do it. Intercepted. That's EP. Let's go. One of those days for this offense. Already getting blown out. Now another interception. We're gonna take the knee again on out of here with this uh, with this victory. Down the rest of this block. 
Nothing more we didn't already give up more points than I want to give up. Should be knee. on at 17, but. Takes a knee. All right, and that will do it. We will get a victory in our first game of the season, season six. And this one comes to an end. Our final. I would say that we game, look pretty dominant green, after the 52, first Army, quarter. Jay looked pretty good. A lot better passing than what I was expecting. I figured it would be more on the ground from him, but I'll take that. 300 yards passing against a decent Army team. I'm not going to say they're great. They are a good team. Still don't know why I didn't get a tackle animation there. Ran right by him. And for those who play NCAA 14, you would know what I mean by tackle animation. Usually when you get close enough to an offensive player, they, they, they'll just tackle them. <laughs> but in this case, not. Mike Potts coming to Army and setting up shop. And that was the play that they shouldn't have scored on. I don't know what this guy did. Number 21. <laughs> what was that? <laughs> I guess he felt sorry for him. All right. We have the game stats here. Of course, we've seen Jay Jackson was the player of the game. Went 13 of 19 for 305. Four TDs. No interceptions. And he was sacked twice. Not really too concerned about that right now. On the ground, we got Joseph Knight with 12 attempts for 71 yards. Not too bad. Not too bad. In the receiving department, we got Mike Potts, who caught five balls for 174 yards and two TDs. So he's picking up right where he left off last season. D Hill also chipped in with 70 yards on three receptions and a TD. On the defensive side, we got Kelvin Alexander with 13 tackles, six tackles for a loss, and four sacks. That boy was on a mission. We also got Terrence Harper with nine solo tackles, one assisted, two tackles for a loss. Didn't have a sack, but that's okay. Adam Nelson, another one of those outside linebackers. He had nine tackles, four tackles for a loss, and a sack. Eric Rams also had five solo tackles, and he had an interception as well in the end zone. Shout out to Eric Rams. Clint Stevenson had the only deflection of the game on the kick return side we have zach massey with three kick returns for 126 yards they just kept kicking it to him for some reason he gonna he probably gonna be the return of the year if they keep kicking it to him like that all right we have a few games around the country we got marshall taking down miami of ohio 42 to 38 we got unc taking down ecu 35 to 11 we got boston college taking down georgia southern 27 to 21 we got troy over boise state 35 to 28 we got usa 58 to 38 over louisiana tech and we got colorado over colorado state 35 to 28 take a look at the game stats here we of course came out slow which i'm not really surprised new team new starting quarterback you know a lot of new faces out there on the field for us but we finally get together in the second quarter as we go 21 to 0 and then we go 21 to 3 in the third and we just coasted in the fourth and got out of there with a 52 to 24 victory we lost the first down battle the rushing yard battle but we dominated on the passing side we also won a turnover battle and we barely edged them out in time of position offensive player of the game goes to jay jackson of course defensive player of the game goes to kelvin alexander i mean uh, i don't really feel like it was any question about that the man had 13 tackles six tackles for a loss four sacks and a forced fumble okay we can take a quick look at the recruiting board not a whole lot going on right now but we will look at these custom recruits in detail since we only have four Looks like we have a good chance at getting Caleb McDonald right now, which is good. We got Kerry, Campbell Jr. Doesn't look like we're going to be able to get him. Looks like he's focused on going to Virginia. I think he's from Virginia. He is. Looks like he wants to stay home. I'm not mad at that. I'm just mad that we can't get the custom recruits. <laughs> we got Caddy Williams here. Doesn't look like we're going to be able to get him either. Looks like he wants to go to Notre Dame. On the other hand, we got Caleb Michael. Looks like he either wants to go to Ohio State or Bowling Green. Maybe we can pull it off. I hope we can. And we are in the lead on Teddy Ginn. I really like that. Teddy Ginn can come here and be my friend. As for the rest of the recruits, we do have a wide receiver on the board. And that's only because we have a senior 
wide receiver leaving. Have a tackle here. Just a couple guys to fill in spots where seniors are leaving. I'm not really going after any skilled players. As you can see, we got defensive guys, offensive line guys, a receiver, and the rest are custom recruits. We actually have five custom recruits. I'm tripping. I thought we only had four. But anyway, that's pretty much it for the uh, recruiting board. I guess we can take a look at the top 25. Doesn't look like there was any movement after week one. Alabama sitting at one. USC sitting at two, even though we dominated USC last year. Okay. <laughs> Florida sitting at three, even though they lost in the first round of the playoff. And BGSU sitting at four. Then we got Clemson at five. Nebraska at six. Mm, okay. We got Georgia at seven. Houston at eight. California at 9 and BYU sitting at 10 and we'll scroll down to finish out the top 25. Ohio State moves up a spot even though they didn't play a game. Baylor also moved up a spot even though they didn't play a game. Somebody probably lost. Okay who's the team that lost? NC State. There it is. That's the movement right there. They got blew out by Alabama. Oh boy. Then we got Miami, Minnesota, Arizona State, and Charlotte is the new team on the top 25 poll. Probably not going to be any conference games played. We'll take a look at the West side just to make sure and i do not see so there were no conference games played this week and we got the heisman watch we got jeremy ford from georgia that's a familiar face we got albert ward from kansas state we got eric cantrell from florida we got antonio bean from minnesota and we got oka kelvin alexander from bgsu oh my god after he had the game of his life on the defensive side of the ball those 13 tackles six tackles for a loss four sacks and a forced fumble that man was on the qb's head all game and kelvin alexander also got the ncaa player of the week the defensive player of the week i should say all right if you made it to this part of the episode you already know how i go on this show it's the outro bitch Yes, sir. We got us a solid win against Army to start off the season. I didn't notice that we have three straight away games to start off the season, but we have to take that in stride. And I feel like we will be all right until we get to this Alabama game. I don't know how this is going to go. <laughs> But anyway, we have number 20 Notre Dame on the schedule next week, next episode. And we're going to try to do the same thing that we did against Army against Notre Dame. Hopefully it works out. I really, really hope it works out. But if you haven't already, make sure you hit that like button, subscribe to the channel, hit that notification bell. That way you'll be notified every time I drop a video just like this one. And also drop a little something down in the comments for your boy. And if you comment enough, you will make it to the shout out list. And speaking of the shout out list, I got it right here. Shout out to Product Visuals, Optimal Prime 870, The Rapper 10,000, Warmaster 777, Thomas Bays, Arsenio Patillo, Eric Rams, Dare, Matt Aarons, DRNA Patterson, Andrew Minton, Roscoe underscore 34, Clips, Slap Shark 23, Ethan Marlowe, JK YouTube, Tony Hawkins, Jordan Barker, Tim Alvarez, Afro Magic, Smoking A609, and Caleb Harper. Shout out to all you guys. Really, really appreciate y'all supporting the channel, doing all those great things that you do. <laughs> but I ain't gonna hold y'all up too much longer, man. I am your HC. This is BG. We are in season six. Oh boy, four times in a row. Can we do it? We off to a good start. I'm out.